Hi, it's Melissa. Welcome to Messy Missy Creates. I'm going to work in my journal. Yes, right? Um, anyway, we'll see how this goes. I feel a little out of practice. Um, today is the 5th. Um, I have not done any more than what you saw me do uh, in the last video. So, let's see. This is the... I cut out some of those. I think I only cut out through the 3rd. Yeah. Um, so, oh, I hope I have those handy. Well, yes, I do. Okay. I thought, I got, I thought of everything else. Watch me forget the numbers. But first, I want to show you a few things. I was looking for, um, some December prompts. And I think we talked about that in the last video. Um, how I kind of like doing those, especially for December. Um, there's a couple different types, uh, two that I'm going to talk about. There might be more, I don't know, but one where you have a certain thing, um, like on a certain day, like on the first, you do this, the second you do this. Um, those are fun, but then there's also this kind where you kind of just pick one for what, what suits you that day. Um, there's benefits to both the, um, anyway, not going to get into all that, but so, I had trouble finding, like, a December daily, whatever. I had trouble finding the prompts. Um, so, I found these from Visualized NZ. Um, I learned of her through February and June. And she put out, um, these are free. You, I joined her Facebook group and signed up for her newsletter. I think that's how I did it. Um, but I know you have to find, sign up for her Facebook group. It's called, oh goodness, go to her Instagram account and it's on her link. I want to say it's like visual vibes or something like that on Facebook. But anyway, it was really easy to find and, um, she has a, an actual album in her group called December Days. So, um, I like some of these. Some of these, I don't know what they are. There's more than you need for the month, I do believe. So, um, you know, you don't have to do all of them. But I like, you know, Christmas is coming, checking a little list twice, festive menu, holiday tunes, party time. I'm not going to read all of them to you, but um, this is one I don't know. Um, little Grinch, Magical Moments. Spreading kindness, holiday cheer around the table, wrapping up. Anyway, so in my search for those prompts, that's where I that's where I landed, and I printed them out. Um, I was afraid that I couldn't see them because I had a hard time seeing the picture, but once I printed them, I can see them just fine. So I'm gonna set those to the side, and I'm then okay. I'm a Patreon of February and June. So, I go to print out her printables for this month, and lo and behold, look at this. Movie marathons, um, oh, summer celebrations, because it's summer there. Winter Wonderland, Christmas cookies, family time, love, good night, feasting, making a list. These technically could be used as prompts, um, but if not, they're definitely going to be fun to use in the journal. This is just a bigger version of some of those movie marathon um elf antics christmas cookies family yeah i already read all those making a list filled with wonder wish list and then this these are her cut aparts i think my printer is running low on ink these are a little pinker than they look like they were going to be in the thing but i think that's my printer and um, you know, when you, when your printer runs low on ink, it doesn't run low on all the colors at the same time. So when you eliminate one color, you get either like they turn out really pink or really blue or whatever. Um, anyway, I was talking about the other thing is I was talking about needing journal spots, you know, for the pages. Now I'm going to have one white page per day, so that should be fine. Because my pages were one-sided, not two-sided. But look, she always does little journaling spots. I don't always print them because I didn't really need them. Um, she does, these are smaller ones. They're like, I'm going to say like three by four, just off glance. 
Yeah, three and a half by two and a half, maybe. Candy cane, gingerbread. Look at the cute little cork head reindeer. Christmas trees, presents, holly, ornaments. Um, here's some bigger ones. These are three and a half by five and a half, five and a quarter, whatever. You know, you get the, the general idea of that. So, um, I think there's two pages, yes. So there's one, two, one page of the smalls, um, two pages of the larger ones, and then these are fun. Um, I guess, would you maybe write on the back of them? If you want it to make like a little flip. Again, I think my printer printed out very pink heavy. Okay, so I'll show you that in a minute. Here is, I think I showed this in the last video. Here's how my, um, I didn't have the full sheet done when on my last video. So I did these very large so that they would, um, you know, you'd have, I wanted a variety. So, um, I may go back and list these individually at, um, at some point, but I'm not going to do it right this second. But anyhow, and then this was my clip art sheet. I did not show you this in the video last time because I didn't have it printed up. I didn't have it finished. But Merry Christmas, New Year's Eve, some um, little ornament journaling, just small little journaling spots. Um, here's the 31 because the other pages are 1 through 15 and then 16 through 30. So a poinsettia I drew, a Santa I drew, the ornaments I drew, the lights. Could have done a better job on them, but, you know, it is what it is. Um, okay, so that's all of that. Those are, all of it is a set in my Etsy shop. Yes, I know that I got them out late. Um, but I did it as fast as I could. So, um, then we have Prompt Week from February and June as well that started yesterday. So today is Tuesday the 5th. So, um, I'm going to be doing that for this week's and then just some other stuff I printed out. So, I, um, I have some things printed out for, you know, the first few days and then I have some, what did I, I have my little cheat sheet here so I can remember what I did. So... What day was the first? Friday was the first. And I am going to use the, my tree, I probably should have started with today, but I'm gonna go ahead and cut this out and put it on the first. Um, I don't know if I have you in frame or not. Okay. It's a little bit of a dark picture. I doubt you can see it, but I can see it. Um, might as well go ahead and trim the rest of the white off of it. Seems how I did not leave a white border. I probably should have given the color on the page. But each year we go back so that we can remember how we decorated it the previous year. Because um, inevitably we can't remember which goes on first or what goes where. So we always have to go back and pull up a picture in our phone. So this way I can just pull out my December journal. I don't have to fumble back through years of um, pictures. This day I spent making cards. So this is green foiled card stock. says all the joy. So I thought I would put that on here somewhere. I've got pictures of my cards that I made somewhere. Well, oh. Oh, I was going to bring them in here and show them to you, but I didn't. Because these pictures will be rather small for you to see. Um, let's see. There's the cards. I'll cut them up. And... Um, yeah, I think that's the day that I started making my journal. So all this goes on here. Now, do I want them cut apart? I might just slip them in here for right now. Work on that in a minute. So, 
Let's see, this was for Sunday. We went to see Miss Sue at the hospital. I'll put that on Sun Sunday the third. Friday, Saturday, Sunday, yeah. Okay. Oh, and Sam's. We did the Sam's trip after we went to the hospital. Um, so I'm going to see if I have, now that I printed off the rest of these. Hmm. I was going to see if there was another one on there that I liked better. But I think I'm going to stick with that one. And yeah. Put that like that. I'm going to jump ahead. I'm kind of all over the place. I'm sorry. It'll take me a second to kind of get my bearings here. Um, but as I'm cutting these, I will tell you, this day right here, I started with a pain in my side. And it was intermittent sharp pains. And I kind of, I didn't ignore them. I just... They were hard to ignore, but I was just kind of home all day and I, um, somewhere in the back of my mind, I, I figured I knew about what it was or what it likely was. And I sort of anticipated them getting worse, that they were getting worse. Um, I figured I was going to end up in the ER over the weekend. I did not. I managed to not do that. So that was good. Yep, that's the fourth. And it does not match my pages. But we're going to make that work anyway. I figured that would happen with that blue. But, you know, some people do blue at Christmas. So I wanted to kind of include all the colors. Um, we're a more, and I, I'm going to say traditional, I'm assuming this is their traditional colors, kind of the red, green, gold, you know, that, that sort of thing. Um, our tree basically has red and green, red, actually it doesn't even have that much green on it. It's mostly red and I don't know. Red, white. Well, the tree is green, so it still has green. Anyway, um, somebody asked me in the comments. I think somebody asked me in the comments. I haven't. Let's see. I think that's what I saw. I haven't answered yet because I was going to wait. Um, will I be able to cut this and flap it open? Um, yes, the smart thing would have been to cut those before I sewed in the journal. But I really didn't want to take the time to do it prior to and I, either way I still would have had the option of like a tuck or something like that um I can't find anything well let's try this um it would be easier just to glue down one side if you wanted a tuck so I that and I just I was kind of in a hurry making my journal so I didn't um didn't take the time to do that. So, I think I will be able to come in here. It won't be right along the edge. I'll have to cut in a little bit. But I think I'll be able to cut it. Like I said, I might regret doing that. But I thought it would distribute the weight of the paper a little bit better. And if not, at least my page. Even if I just glue this down and don't use it for anything... At least this page has a little bit of color on it instead of just the, the white. So I thought I would try it. I might actually put that one over there this time. Um, what am I looking for? Looking for a Saturday and Sunday. What did we say? No, I'm not. I'm looking for a Monday and Tuesday. Let's see what I have. Um, on this page. Oh, I have it right here. I have, do have a blue Monday. Not that I 
you know, again, don't have any blue on this page, but it's all right. It will be okay. Um, again, if I would have sat there and really had a calendar and looked at what day, you know, looked at my journal and, but that, that would have been very time consuming. And if I would have started back in like September or October, that would have been fine. But I did not. The name of my game here lately is Last Minute. And what said this was a Tuesday. I'm going to use this red polka dot and green one. Um, I tried to make all three. There's three Mondays, three Tuesdays, three Wednesdays. Um, I couldn't fit four on here without making them smaller than I wanted. So I just put three. Um, I always have to print a second sheet anyway, just about. Unless the month has a perfect 28 days, which we know only one month has that. So I... I always have to print them again. So I made the third column much larger, just in case you like a larger one. Anyway, okay. So back to my, what I was telling you. And I had clip art that I was going to use. And what did I do with it? I don't know. And then I need to pick my prompts for these days I lost that one sheet mm, maybe I cut it off nope there was still one more picture that goes on here one more just clip art I have this is prompt week I'll find the other in a minute it always turns up it just never turns up right when I want it to turn up so, I'm going to cut Monday and Tuesday. Monday is taste. Document a delicious Christmas recipe you plan to make this month. Well, there's probably more than one, but the first one that came to mind was my grandmother's snickerdoodles. And I have my... This is my original recipe that, like, back from the 90s, I think, that I wrote... Um, my aunt gave me the recipe and, um, she was reading it to me over the phone and I was writing it down. There's like layers of flour and whatever all over this. This is going back in my recipe book, but I made a, made a photocopy of it somewhere. Here it is. So this will go on Monday. And well, ooh, I did not cut that straight at all. I thought I was cutting it straight, but I did not. That would make a good um, writing spot. Let's see, where's Monday? So I'm just kind of um, just tucking stuff in and then I'll start working. Yeah, I could have done that a little different. I might still make that like a flip. Or I could make that a writing spot and just tuck it in in this pocket. And put this somewhere on here. Let's see what else I have to put on that day. I want to get all my stuff in the on the right days. And then I'll start putting something together. So this is Tuesday. See what's on your Christmas movie watch list right now. Well, I have this. Um, I have been watching, among other things, we watched Home Alone for the first time this year. Um, over the weekend. We had a very lazy Saturday. I think I already mentioned that. It was, um, anyway, this is the Great American Christmas Channel, or Family, Great American Family Channel. This is their Christmas lineup. So, I've watched, I don't know, I think we're on 13, 14, 
I haven't watched all of them, but I have them recorded. So that's going on. This is my watch list. In addition, those are the things I watch by myself. My husband doesn't know. He did watch one of them with me. Oh, here we go. This is what I was looking for. So I did end up going to the doctor today. Um, I, I don't know why I was over there doing that. I, my garbage can, I guess. I thought I was doing that over my garbage can, but... Um, yeah, so my pain in my side has persisted. It did not escalate to the point that I felt like I wanted to go to the ER or needed to go to the ER. Um, anyway, so... I just kind of chilled all weekend, which it was rainy anyway, so that worked out perfectly. This I'm going to put on this first day, because that's when it started. And it really lasted all weekend through, and then when it was still hurting yesterday, um, I and I had not gone to the ER as of that point, um, I called the doctor's office and got in with my primary care. And, yeah. So, I am going to have an ultrasound, obviously, and this is what I thought, too. It, it felt like um, gallbladder, so waiting to see what we're going to do with that. Surgery was not on my agenda for December, so I'm not thrilled about that. Um, or the thought of that. I don't know that I would get... I think if it's not an urgent matter, um, meaning if I don't have a blockage or, you know, like a stone blocking something, um, then I think we might be able to, they gave me some medication to see if they could calm it down, you know, cause the inflammation and everything. Um, and, yeah, well, I think we're going to see if we can um, maybe, you know, depending on what the ultrasound shows. I have the ultrasound this week. So, depending on what that shows, um, you know, maybe I can hold off. But if it shows that it's blocked, then they'll want to do it more urgently. So, yay, right? So, I'm trying... Even though I'm in pain, I'm trying to get as much done as I can. Like my shopping, my wrapping. I don't think I can do all the cooking ahead of time, that far ahead of time. But anyway, what else has to go on this one? Not much. Um, yeah. So, like I said, that was not on my agenda. But, you know, what they say about life is what, hap what happens while you're making plans. So, yep. So, I'm trying to say, okay, so this is what I have for this day. In addition to whatever prompt I choose. Let's read through the prompts. Um... <sighs> Adventful. <laughs> Um, sunshine on snowshine. I don't have that. Christmas day at, oh no, that's Christmas day. Um, you know what? I wrapped presents today. That got me going on my present wrapping. Oh wait, but wait, I still had more. So I think I'm going to put wrapping up on this um the only thing is is it doesn't feel like wrapping up it feels like um i mean i wrapped presents but it doesn't feel like wrapping up implies to me that you're like wrapping up your your to-do list you know what i mean like you're almost done 
so I don't feel like I'm quite wrapping it up yet. Okay, so this was Saturday. This was the SEC Championship, um, we watched that. Alabama won over Georgia. I could not believe it. I mean, I could believe it, but I was pleasantly surprised. Um, this is, we do, we did it a little early this year. I'm going to put this on Friday, on day one. Um, we went to, we do our, I think I talked about this in the last video. We do our little date night at the mall. And we did it, um, like I said, we did it a little early this year. Hmm. And this one, if I need it, I can put on... Saturday, too, I think. Yeah, because I think I did um, finish up my journal. This was, I made the video of finishing up my journal. That's what it was. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Let's see if I can get something glued in. What do you think? So, I don't know what else I would use for today. The happy birthday. I know when I'm going to use that. Um, Christmas is coming. I figured I'd put that on the first. Uh, except. Um, I think there was one about a tree. Um. So like on the Christmas watch list. So I'll put that for, t that's what I'll use for today. Because this is, um, this prompt kind of coincides with that prompt. So I will cut that one out. I think I'll do that one for today. And I'll save the wrapping up for, um, I mean, I just got started today. So I don't feel like I'm wrapping up. You know what I'm saying? course you do because I already said it there we go so on the Christmas watch list so that's for today and oh around the Christmas tree I, I'll put that one on the fur on the yeah the one where I have my tree picture I don't think the idea is to do these in hindsight I think it is to do them, you know, and make a plan, but I'm not, yeah, that looks good, around the Christmas tree, and then I have my, my Christmas picture, I might want to back that, mm. what could I back that with, I don't know, but that day's getting pretty full, so, okay, so day one is around the Christmas tree, and two, we watched football. We did watch a Christmas movie. Three, I'm trying to think of things that we did because I'm, I'm doing this after the fact. Mm. Oh, I could have done December Romance for the first one. I don't know. Anyway, I'll figure it out. Let's see, what are our other options? Uh, holiday tunes. Yeah, I can always... Oh, Christmas is coming. That's right. That's what I was going to use. I don't know. I might not be able to... Um, this only at Christmas. There was something I had in mind for that. But I don't know. Let's look and see what these little prompts are. Or what's on these. Because I might. Um, I might combine them. I haven't made Christmas. Movie marathon. That might be what I used for Saturday. Because we really did. And it was so nice. We don't ever do that. 
but we just sat. He was supposed to have fished Saturday, and it stormed so bad over the weekend that they canceled the tournament. That, um, yeah. A little Christmas tree I could use for that one. Let's see, this was Saturday. That works. I like that. I could just put wrapping gifts for today. Um, I think that's on the big one and the little one, isn't it? Okay. Deck the halls. Candy Cane Lane, Santa Claus, Starry Night. Where did my... I don't know. I forgot what I was looking for. That's okay. All right, let's get a page done. Now that I have rambled and babbled and... I know I'm doing this one. I know I could have cut that straighter. Wow. Probably should have taken those to my paper trimmer. And maybe the idea of these is to pull a prompt out like at the beginning of the day and do something according to that prompt. Um, that's not how the first five days of my month is going. So, because I'm, I'm doing everything kind of in reverse. But it is what it is, right? So, I'm looking at something like that. I might put that down here. I've got this. Yeah, so I'm sitting on a stool right now. Not exactly comfortable. I'm not in excruciating pain at the moment, but I am not... Uh, not comfortable at the moment. But I wanted to get some journaling done. And... Yeah. I do not want to have to have surgery between now and Christmas. I know that it's not that big of a surgery. Well, it's not supposed to be. I've known some people that have had a really hard time with it for whatever reason. Like, after the fact. Uh, my husband had it a few years ago, and he did okay. It's not a real long recovery time, but my body it doesn't always go according to other people's schedule either. And I know that. Okay, so this is what I'm looking at. Now I have to decide if I'm going to flap this up. Um, I had a plan for that. Do I know what it was? Not really. I have my scraps of paper right here, and I have, oh, this is what I was looking for, the little writing spots, and these things. I need to go replace my ink cartridges and then reprint them. I was wondering what this would look like if I cut it down a little further. That's kind of cute, isn't it? That for the backing. Let me see if I can cut it down a little bit so you can see more of the, the backing and less of this just white paper. Um, I am supposed to still work the clinic this week and I'm going to try to do that. We closed, they closed the clinic for two weeks around the holidays anyway. And so I don't want to miss, I'm only going to put in two days this month as it is. So I don't want to miss that. Um, those two days, if I can help it. They would certainly understood if I couldn't, but um, I had some projects I was working on last week so i would like to go back in and finish them fin and finish them i don't know that that really matches my page but i think it looks cute and i think that will work oh my goodness i'm not cutting straight tonight look at that yeah definitely i'm gonna have to take this to my paper trimmer because 
we, we just can't have that. That matches that page, that paper really well. So, okay, back to this. What am I going to do with this? So, I think I am, given that I don't have anything else to put on this page. Um, let's, let's do it. Let's try it. So that you know whether or not it works. Um, do I want to do that? <laughs> Hmm, yeah, let's try it. It's obviously not going to be straight. Let me see if my smaller scissors would be helpful. Um, you know what would work? Is, is If I can just cut through one sheet of paper and not five, that would be awesome. I'm doing it very lightly. Looky there. Almost like I knew what I was doing. I did that very light. Um, as a matter of fact, when I do it again, I would recommend I have a little um, cutting, a small cutting mat um, you know, to use with a exacto knife. So I'd probably cut, cut it under or put it underneath there. So, anyway, okay. So the answer to that question is yes, that worked. So I'm going to put this down here. Let's just start gluing something. And actually, I think I'm going to use this glue. This is that pinning gear. So, um, yeah, I felt really discombobulated. When you haven't journaled in a while, I mean, it's been at least a month since I journaled. And um, so I didn't do any in November. If you're new here, welcome. Um, I was, uh, did not journal in November. And... I'm okay with that. Um, I think I'm going to put this on here and then I will put the information about my appointment underneath there. And I only want to glue her to maybe the bottom of her dress. Again, I forgot to get my little page. Uh, the little thing that I usually glue on. Okay, words are difficult tonight. The dry wax paper. So I'm probably getting all kind of AF excess glue on my paper here. Okay, so that's on there. And then I will put about my appointment under here. Um, let's see, if I want to put any lines. I think I could draw lines on that. I could use one of the, I don't want to use one of the journaling spots on here because this is just plain white paper. I don't see the need in that. Um, I am looking for a marker. Which should not be difficult. I'm gonna see if this green one will work. I don't want to write on this on my snickerdoodle recipe. Um, surely I have a little piece of paper somewhere. No, that's a blue green. That's not what I want. Here are. I could do this red. Okay, that's a possibility. That's what I want. That's what I want. I think I'm just going to go ahead and do this whole page that way. I hadn't glued that on yet. So, that way I have something to write on. And I try to do this before I glue my images down. Sometimes that happens, sometimes it doesn't. 
Um, do I want to bring them all the way down? I probably want to bring them down at least to where this folds or, you know, where it covers that. So that makes some good, um, private journaling spots if you want it to be. I mean, you could always put a piece of washi tape if you didn't want anybody to see what you wrote there. So, I mean, there's only 101 ways to do that, but that's one of them. And, yeah, I think I'm going to like that at the top. Okay, so I have my doctor there. And I have that little flap so I can go back and write about that. If I want to carry that down, I can. I should have done it before I glued that on, though. And I'm going to put the watch list. I'm going to glue this to here. I do like that. I like that background. Um, here's an extra just sheet of paper so that I don't get glue all over my desk. Um, not like I don't have enough books or magazines to use as my glue book, you know, but I just don't think about having them handy. There. So, I like that. And... ambulance. Oh, this was the other thing. I knew there was something else. So this was about a watch list and this was about a watch list. So that worked out perfectly. And I debated on, no, I don't want to. I'm just going to glue it down. I debated on doing that as a flip up so that I could write on there. I, but I can go back and just check off the ones that I've watched. So I like it. Um, I'm wondering what prompt I will choose for tomorrow so that I can do it in advance and not after the fact. And I could write more presents. Um, well, I was trying to think. Okay, there we go. Like that. And then this. And then we, wow, we have a day almost done. Only took me forever. Um, and then obviously there's some that we watch every year. I mean, like Home Alone, and we watch, um, I don't know what else the the normal oh we watched oh um I know what we watched the other day and it was cute we love Shrek we love cartoons anyway but we watched um there was a I think it was new it was new to me it was called Shrek the Halls and that was really cute I thought it was very cute so yeah, one, if I was thinking if I wanted a little spot right there, but I don't think I'm going to need it. You know what else I could put there if I wanted to write something? That would be a great spot for one of those. One of these ornaments, maybe the red one right here. You know, if I wanted to elaborate on that, I don't think I'm going to do it right this second. And... I know what else I was going to use. Did I cut it out? I was going to put wrapping gifts. Because I did wrap gifts. And then I rested. I got my side kind of calmed down a little bit after going to the doctor and, you know, her poking and prodding on it, which made it hurt worse for a little while. And then... So I got that, I, you know, got kind of calmed down from that, and then I went to go put a little laundry in and leaned over the washer, and, oh, that hurt. 
Um, I think it was a big one. Yeah, here's a there's a bigger one if I want it. No. Okay, let's see. I'm not um this spot I'm gonna reserve for I'm if I need more room here. And what else? Uh, Monday. This is the document a delicious recipe. So if I do it like this, oh, that's where I was trying to decide if I was going to do it like this or if I was going to make this a tag, maybe. I could just put lined paper on it. I mean, I could just write on it like that. Um, wait, I have... Is that big enough? Sorry, it doesn't have to be colored paper. Um, I have graph paper. I have ledger paper. And what am I reaching for? Plain white paper. So, and it's not very thick at all. So, if I just line that like that, then I could use that as a tuck spot here. And then I would put this up here. And then... I don't have to put this on every day, but... Um... Why not, right? It's what was going on. So. Hmm. Anyway, how's your journal going? Um, what do you think of the little top flips? Do you think you'll try it? If you haven't already, I mean... I am. Um, I think I'm going to like them a lot. And I'm, I'm trying to be okay with this blue. So I could just glue this straight down. Those are my options. I could put this right here and just let that page be that page. And I can deal with this blue a little bit better over here. Um, and then here, not sure if I'm going to use anything in that. Okay. So that's my idea for that day. Let's go back to the first. I really want to, um, uh, my crooked cutting again. These long scissors are supposed to help you cut straighter, which that's great, except, um, yeah. Uh, the other thing I thought about changing that, I don't know when I would use that again, though. Um, the, what day did, did we do this on the first? I was thinking about using that December romance. Um... Maybe we'll go back and do it again. We usually only go once a year. So, I don't know that. Let's see if this is. Nope. That definitely would match. Makes it kind of dark, but. The picture is dark. And that covers up part of the tree. I don't like that. Nope. Don't like that. And I already cut it. Um, maybe I won't back it with anything. Hmm. Ledger paper, anyone? Nope. I just want the smallest little border around. I wish I had left the white border. I have an idea. 
Um, what did that piece of paper I was using to glue on? Or let me try this one with candy canes. I could cut that down a little further. No, that won't work either. I have this tiny little, I just want the tiniest the little like white border around it or it doesn't have to be white, but something lighter maybe is what I'm looking for. My eye wants something lighter there. Sorry if I just hit you with that piece of paper. Yeah, I and that could have been resolved by leaving that border. And I cut it off. Okay. Note to self, remember the, um, I like having that little glue paper right here. I'm used to having it to glue on. There we go. That will work. Otherwise, you end up with glue all over everything. Um, and maybe I'm just putting too much glue, but I like it edge to edge. Um, unless I'm doing it tentatively, and then I... Oh. Okay, we won't talk about how crooked that... Oh, no. Yeah, we won't talk about how crooked that is. Maybe we can fix it a little bit. Okay, and then that goes right there. And then this goes up here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like it. That will work. And then some of this other stuff, I haven't even shown you the pictures of the cards that I made. Christmas tree, so I used that one. So I don't know, are you using prompts? Did you find prompts anywhere? Um, I mean, it's kind of, it's not too late. It's, it's getting that way pretty quick, but it's not too late. Um, I like this all the joy, but I have a feeling I'm gonna put this on um, like maybe a, because there's three pictures of cards. I'm trying to do better at taking pictures of the cards that I make. And so if I know that I'm going to put them in my journal, it will kind of hold me accountable for, so this was Little Snowman, All the Joy kind of holding present by a tree. I think I showed you these. Um, pretty sure I showed you those. So, and I don't know where she's going to go, and I don't know if I'm going to use this on that one or not. Um, I would like, would like to buy a vowel. No. Um, do I want to use one of the big journaling spots here? And then put it, put it in as a tag. Um, I can always print more. Hmm. This is my little December. I haven't even opened this one. Um, I have all these notepads. Like for, every, I think I have one for every month. They make good. Um, I just use the magnets in my craft stuff. They're just a hair taller than my page. Not by, no, but they're within the journal. Yeah. So I can put these pictures of these cards. 
on here if I really want to. Here it is. Trim that one down a little bit more. Um, let's see if that fits. It does. So I don't know that that makes my heart real, real happy or my eye. I don't think it makes anything real happy, but it will do. And then that way it'll fit in there. I could just put it on the page, but I feel like if I have a pocket, I should use the pocket. Does that make sense? And I think I'm just going to put this right here. I love my die cuts. And yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and put this down. And then glue these down. Let me get this out from underneath here. They're not sticky notes. They are just... Um, you know what I mean? They're not, they don't have any sticky on them. They are just, oh, they're magnetic. Like, you know, that would go on your fridge. There we go. I don't want to cover up that December. Good job. I just got glue everywhere. Um... So, the doctor, I was sort of hoping, oh my goodness gracious, I was sort of hoping that the ultrasound would be, I think it's Friday, I was sort of hoping that it would be before, you know, sooner rather than later, which I mean, that's not that bad, it's just, I know they did it kind of a stat thing. But that was the, she said that was the first available that she had. So, um, all right. Now I know that I glued that corner to corner. Why did that not stick? So, I can go in there like that. And, oh, I did not bring... Yeah, I like that right there in the center. And glue this day and day and date. Yeah. We're getting there. I'm getting the hang of this again. It is, um, you definitely get out of practice, out of the habit, out of practice, not just out of the habit, but out of practice. Now, I could cut that snowman off, and that ended up matching that page pretty well, too, huh? Oh, I do have this. This was just the, when I made the Christmas journal, or part one of the video. Um, where do I want to put it? I don't know. But I do want to do this right here. I want to glue this. I think I liked it right there. This is my art glitter glue. I just put it in another. Oh, I forgot this one stopped up in it. Okay, so I'll have to glue that. Yeah, I don't like that. It needs a pin in the nozzle like the art glitter glue one has. Because that one stops up every five minutes. But yeah, I'm going to put that there, I think. Kind of like it there, too. But I like it there. Um, Now, where do I want that? I don't know. When I go back and write, sometimes I wait on some things just to kind of finalize. Um, You know, when I know where I'm going to write stuff. Well, how much time do... Oh, I got to stop. Um, my husband will be home soon, and I've been yammering for a whole hour already, so... But... Yeah, we got a little bit done anyway. Not as much as I wanted to. But... I think I might just put that there. 
anyway, I, ha I have a feeling I'm going to write all the way down here, so I don't want to glue that on just yet, but, all right, I'm going to let y'all go, and, um, I am going to glue that there, though, and then I'll write on the, no, I'm not. The back side of that is textured. It might not be good to write on. I might have to use a journaling spot even on the white pages. But anyway, all right. Well, I'm going to stop here and go lay down and for a little while. And I will, um, I will see you again soon. If I was told to go, you know, if anything got worse, just to go straight to the ER. Um, and hopefully that does not happen between now and Friday or ever, but, um, we shall see, but I will, um, I will keep you, um, probably come back and make another video tomorrow, maybe, maybe just do tomorrow's page, and, uh, hopefully I'll get back in here and finish up one through five and get that done, and, because there's really not that much to put on two and three, so, Anyway, y'all have a wonderful day and or evening or whatever time it is there. And I will see you in the next video. Bye.